Hello, everybody. Welcome to Orgasmic Living. I'm your host, Patty Alfonso. How does it get any better than this? I'm going to do a little bit of housekeeping while people find me. Um, Orgasmic Living is my weekly show. And if you would like to sign up and get more information about that, you can go to orgasmicliving.live. You also get to let me know what it is that you would like to know about orgasmic living. So yay. Um, we had a whole bunch of people sign up for today from all over the world and I want to acknowledge everyone that is here. So we have people from Australia, Brazil, Canada, Croatia, Denmark, France, Germany, India, Ireland, Italy, the Netherlands, Romania, Slovenia, Sweden, the United Kingdom, and all over the US. If you don't know me, my name is Patty Alfonso. I am known to many as the Orgasmic Body Whisperer, and I'm super, super excited to be here with you guys today. Now, as I said, uh, when you sign up at orgasmicliving.live, you get to tell me what it is that you would like to know about living orgasmically. And this week's question comes from Millie in Ireland. And I actually thought it was the perfect question to get us started. So she asks, how do you activate orgasmic energy in my body and being as a daily practice? And actually a lot of people had this question, <laughs> how do you live orgasmically? How do you do that? How do you do that? And I think that the first step is to undefine, undefine everything that we have defined um, about what orgasms are. <laughs> and so I wanted to read for me to you guys from my book, uh, Your Body as the Creation of Consciousness, because I have a section in this book about the energy of orgasm. And that is what this show is going to be about. The energies of living orgasmically, the energies that are the body's domain that can actually contribute to you living orgasmically. So I just want to read to you a little bit about this and then we shall discuss. Now, this is, if you don't know, I'm an Access Consciousness Certified Facilitator. And what I'm going to talk to you about in regards to orgasm is based on the Access Consciousness elements of sex. Now, in this world, this beautiful world that we live in, we have actually taken a whole bunch of different energies that are available with our body and we have galumped them. I'm going to I'm going to show you. Well, if you're watching live, if you're watching in the future, you may not see. So, we have galumped them into this one thing that we call sex. So, one of the um one of the sort of to be's and do's about living orgasmically is about ungalumping those energies and getting really clear on those energies uh, individually and how they can play together. Now, if you don't know much about me and you're, you're new to my body of work, I, I'm really passionate about bodies <laughs> and loving your body and living orgasmically because I personally lived completely disconnected from my body for the first 30 years of my life. And even though I was doing a lot of personal work and um, personal development and spiritual development and becoming an energy healer, it wasn't until I found the tools of access consciousness and I found this, this idea of, of pulling apart all of these different energies, it wasn't until then that I could actually really get present with my body. And that is due to um, a lot of the trauma and abuse that I experienced growing up and in my adulthood as well. And so being and receiving these energies was not something that I was comfortable with. My body would just shut down or tense up or freeze or run whenever these energies uh, came up when I was around people. And so in ungalumping all of these energies, I was able to practice staying present with all of the different kinds of energies. So 
Back to our original question from Millie. I see that some of you have joined me. Let me know where you are joining me from. I would love to know. Millie in Ireland wants to know, how do you activate orgasmic energy in a body and being as a daily practice? And for those of you that are just joining me, um, one of the ways to do that is to unpack and undefine what the energy of orgasm is. In this reality, we have delegated the energy of orgasm to those 10 seconds that you are trying to get to when you're in bed with another body. <laughs> and that is not actually what the energy of orgasm is. So in order to um, add this energy to your daily life, you want to get really clear on exactly what this energy is. Now, do we want to have orgasm in bed? Absolutely. And wouldn't we like to have that energy in every day of our life? So, like I said, from my book, Your Body as the Creation of Consciousness, the energy of orgasm is the energy of the creation of your life and the creation of your body. It's the energy of total presence and awareness with all of the sensations that your body has to gift to you. So if you are anything like me or anything like a lot of the clients that I work with and you're curious about this energy and you're not sure why, if you are someone who is functioning from the head up, totally in your mind, thinking all of the time, then this energy may not be as available to you as it could be. Again, it is the energy of total presence and awareness with all of the sensations that your body has to give to you. So ponder the last time you were maybe in bed and you had an orgasm. Get present with that energy. Wasn't that a moment of being completely out of control, being completely present with every single sensation in your body, okay? The energy of orgasm is the energy of your body and your being really enjoying your life. The energy of your body and your being really enjoying your life. So that moment that we tend to strive for in the bedroom where your body is completely out of control and there is an, an exponentialization of sensations, right? Sensation is one way to access the energy of orgasm. But you can, you can play with that in your everyday life. So the energy of orgasm is the energy of your body and your being really enjoying your life. So what is it? that you enjoy? What is it that brings your body joy and pleasure? That makes you smile, that makes you laugh out loud, louder than anyone around you. What are those things? And are you including them and choosing them in your life? Or are you busy with the day-to-day -day crazy insanity of trying to function uh, in this reality, right? In this world with the stress and, and the worry that's not going to invite the energy of orgasm into your life. So what are the things that your body really loves to do that would bring her joy and pleasure? The energy of orgasm is when all of the molecules in your body sing with pleasure and joy. <laughs> so I would like to invite you uh, for the next week or so to ask your body, what brings you pleasure and joy? What would be fun for you? Hello, Annie, Lake. welcome, welcome. Um, let me see if there's anything else here. So the question also that I would like to leave you with or invite into your universe is what if your whole life could be an orgasmic experience? There is an energy of creation in orgasmic living. Creation, the creation of your life, the creation of your body. If for whatever reason you are choosing to reject the energies of orgasm that are available for your body, then you are in essence killing your body 
right? The energy of orgasm is the energy of the creation of your life and the creation of your body. So allowing yourself to have that joy, to have that, um, the, the molecules singing throughout your entire body, to whatever it is that that looks like for your body, this is an exploration of what is true for you and what it is that your body loves. I actually can't really tell you. You know, I can tell you some of the things that are fun for my body. Um, I love, recently I've joined a boot camp that I never really thought that I would enjoy, but my body loves the intensity, the intensity of that early, early morning workout. It's 45 minutes, it's high intensity, high impact. And when I leave, all of my molecules are singing, not to mention that I actually have a lot of fun in the workout. So if I mess up or I don't get things, you know, perfectly or the right way, I laugh. I laugh so hard and so loud. All those people think I'm crazy and that is totally okay. So I give you full permission to laugh, to laugh hard and to laugh loud every single day because that activates the energies of joy and pleasure in your body. Um, another form of movement that I really enjoy is that of pole dancing. And if you're familiar with my work, then you, you know that about me. Um, and that is a completely different energetic invitation where the boot camp is about intensity and loud music and, and continuous movement. Pole dancing for me is about getting really present with all of the sensations that are available with my body and really inviting that energy. Hello, Anna. So we have someone here from India. How does it get better? And Anna from Slovenia, welcome. Thank you all so much for being here. Um, now I lost my train of thought. Uh, I guess my point is that you have to include your body in the exploration of living orgasmically. And if you allow your body to show you what that would be like for him or for her, then it may be easier. <laughs> you can't, you kind of can't explore living orgasmically if you're not playing with your body in every moment of every day. So that is that, my sweet friends. I want to leave you with those things to ponder the next week for the next week. And I will be back here um, next week for another episode of Orgasmic Living. Um, if you'd like to submit your questions and find out more about the show, you can check it out at orgasmicliving.live. I would love to hear from you. Hi, Kristen. Um, I think that's it for now. Thank you all for joining me. I think I might have gone live a little bit early, but that's okay. I look forward to seeing you all next week. Let me know what it is that you would like to know now that we have a bit of a clearer sense of what the energy of orgasm can be for you and for your body, undefining the energy of orgasm, uh, pulling it out of the bedroom and into your daily life. The energy of orgasm as the creation of your body right? Um, including your body in the conversation. And I can't wait to see um, what meanderings of consciousness we will play with every week on Orgasmic Living. I adore you all. Thank you for, for being here and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.